PC Perspectives coverage of the 2014 Consumer Electronics Show is brought to you by AMD and the Next Generation A Series APU. Asus has some surprises for us in the motherboard department as well. Uh, how about the Asus Z87 Deluxe with SATA Express? If you've seen some of their Z87 lineup, it may not look very different than what you've seen, except this little bouncy finger here points us to these connections, which are actual SATA Express connections. And these are unique. You notice you've got two connections here that look like standard SATA ports, and you've got this extra little portion here. Now, if you have a SATA Express device, which they're just now kind of starting to be released, it plugs in all as one unit, and it actually acts as a PCI Express connected SSD or storage device. However, if you don't want to use SATA Express, you can still use these SATA connections as standard SATA connections. So this board will have two, four, six, eight standard SATA connections, or you can get four SATA and two SATA ex Express options when those devices actually become available. Now, one other thing we're excited to see is the Thunderbolt EX2. You may have noticed, we I think we did some coverage of the original Thunderbolt EX, only this time we're being promised that this is actually going to be released. This is a Thunderbolt add-on card for Asus motherboards. You can see here on the Z87 Pro, they've got it configured, plugged into a PCI Express slot. You've got one header connection here. Then you have your DisplayPort dongle connection here for your Thunderbolt connection out here. So this allows you to attach Thunderbolt devices, Thunderbolt displays, or just use it as many DisplayPort connection as well. So this, uh, we are being told, is actually going to be sold. It's going to be available very soon. And uh, I'm looking forward to that because I think Thunderbolt adoption kind of suffered this year because of it. So that's the uh, Asus Thunderbolt EX2 and the Asus Z87 Deluxe SATA Express.